Have you ever put an egg in potting soil? In this video I'll show you what it's all about. I'll also show you some other ingenious tricks with eggs that everyone should know. Did you know that when you boil eggs with water, you should never throw away the egg water? Instead you can use it in other ways. First boil your eggs, then remove them from the water and let it cool completely. This is important because you can now use this water to water your plants. The minerals dissolve here in collect in the water and can really help the plant. At most every fortnight you should water them with the egg water. For trick number two you should draw a knife over your eggs. However we do it a little differently because we want to use the eggs themselves in the first step. All we need for this now is the shell. So when you eat eggs you should first keep some shells. When you have enough you need a silicone mold like this. You can now put the egg shells into this mold. It is important that you crush them into small pieces. As soon as the tray is full of eggshells you need more water. Fill it up with water and put it in the freezer. As soon as it's frozen you can take it out of the freezer. And then we can sharpen the knife on top of it. Because the eggshell in combination with water is perfect as a sharpening stone for your knives. Drag it over here at a 20 degree angle several times and the knife is sharp again. Trick number 3 is a real turbo tip, because if you take an egg and turn it like this and it turns very quickly and often, as you can see here, then it's already cooked. If it doesn't turn at all like this egg or only a little bit, then it's uncooked. This is how you can quickly tell a cooked egg from an uncooked egg. Now let's move on to the egg in the potting soil. Before you do this you should use the egg normally, because all you need is the egg shell. You should now crush it in little pieces and place it in the potting soil. Now you can plant a plant here, because the plant can also absorb the valuable minerals through the eggshell and benefit from them. Of course you can also do this with plants outside in your garden. Another super quick tip if you ever need to separate an egg is to take a plastic bottle like this. Squeeze it and approach the yolk with it. Then slowly release the bottle so that the yolk is sucked into the bottle. Lift it up and simply let it out again in another bowl. This is a quick and easy way to separate an egg using a bottle. By the way, there is another way you can optimize the story with the eggshells even further. You should collect some eggshells again, then in the best case you should pulverize them. You can do this with a mortar or for example a coffee grinder. Now grind them until they are really fine powder. Once you have done that, you should put them in a slightly larger container, because now we want to mix it with water. For two eggshells you need one liter of water. Now add the whole thing and stir it really well together. Now it should stand for at least 12 hours. Then pass it through a sieve again and you can water your plants with it. However, as there are a lot of more minerals in, you should make sure to do this every 3 months at the most. Would you also like to know why you should put a bag behind your door? Then take a look at the video I'm linking to you here. You will make me really happy if you click the like button and subscribe to my channel.